Que lo que mi gente. Welcome back to another video. I wanted to 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 really talk about Naruto Shinobi Striker, and I'm gonna get to that. I'm gonna get to that because obviously this is the, the whole point of the video. Uh, first of all, I wanted to mention that some gameplay released not that long ago for Shinobi Striker, and it was in 60 FPS. So if I'm led to believe the game is gonna run at 60 FPS, that's another point. That's another point that the developers get. Okay, because we've asked for a 60 FPS Naruto game from Cyber Connect 2 for a while now. You know, we wanted it back in Storm 3 when they were doing the remaster, which was like the full burst thing. We wanted it then. They didn't give it to us. Then we wanted it on Storm 4. They didn't give it to us. So just to see that the game is going to run a 60 FPS uh, for Naruto Shinobi Striker, uh, it, it makes me happy, man. It makes me happy because they're already showing so much potential for the game you know now we also got uh, information that there's gonna be a beta for shinobi striker okay it's gonna be for japan so right now there's no word on an american version or in a europe version but i'm not really worried because obviously japan's gonna get it first because that's that's basically the, the motherland right i'm not really too worried about it even if they didn't give it to us over here in america or europe I can just make a Japanese PSN ID and download it from there, okay? I'm not too worried about it. But anyways, you know, it, it, like I said, all of these things make me happy. But at the same time, man, it makes me feel uncomfortable because it made me realize, like, damn, dude, like, these developers are already doing things like a beta. They're planning a beta. They're, they, they gave us the custom characters. They're giving us things like mentors and all this shit. Uh, and just in general, man, like, all the good shit that we wanted for a long, long time from Cyber Connect 2 that we never got, they gave it to us like it was nothing, dude. They made a brand new game and already they're giving us shit that we want left and right. You know, and the reason why I started thinking about that was because Cyber Connect 2 was like the top dog for Naruto games, man, since the PS2 days. Um, for those of you guys that don't know, they were the ones responsible for like the Naruto Ultimate Ninja series on the PS2. So it's sad as shit to see that they never really cared about the community. They never really wor uh, worried about whether the game needed any updates or fixes. Yeah, they came out with a, a few patches here and there, but by the time they did that, the game was already dead. And I think the closest thing to a beta that Sabukune 2 Gables was the Naruto Storm Revolution online demo. If you guys have been around the block, you guys know Sabukune 2. Uh, release some kind of demo that you could play online for Revolution, which was actually very fun. It was a very cool thing for them to do. But um, other than that, you know, they didn't really worry too much. Now, the last thing these developers need to do, in my opinion, is keep up with this game. You know, keep up with Shinobi Striker. Make improvements. You know, come out with patches, updates. Let us know either over Twitter, Facebook, whatever platform they have. Let us know about whether they're fixing issues, whether they know about any any issues that the community uh, found, you know, because those things really do matter. You know, when when a developer connects with their uh, with their fan base, it it just makes the game that much more successful. Uh, I mean, a, a good example of that is Overwatch. You know, Overwatch is always coming out with fixes to characters, nerfs and buffs, and all that to make the game more balanced. And in general, they're very in tune with their community. And I I would love to see something like that from these new developers hopefully okay the last thing we need is just you know them coming out with updates coming out with patches letting us know okay hey guys we're working on this don't worry about it we'll give you info uh when we have them you know all that stuff okay anyways let me know what you guys think about this beta let me know what you guys think about the game running in 60 fps because all of those things sound real good to me you know what i'm saying it sounds really good to me um i guess i'll just end the video by saying Cyber Connect 2 can go suck the fattest, most disgusting, most nasty ass dick they can find. Okay? I'm out. Peace.